sat in this dark corner in this room and the reverb from the amp echoed across of this sort of shack. It was a wooden shack and you could hear the echo and the re every time it high note it would just bounce off the walls and and I think from that moment on I always knew that I wanted to be able to play like that. I wanted to be able to record someday capture the sounds that I heard right then and there as I walked in. I went up to this guy afterwards and introduced himself. Um, his name was Watermelon Slim. And um, I gave him a lot of credit for the style of my playing. And I sat down with him and he, he showed me his guitar, three strings. And I said, yeah, man, how's it tuning, you know? And um, he said, you know, it's all the same tuning. Which is where I took a lot of my tuning from. It's every every note on the guitar is the same, the same string. And I said, "Well, how come you only have three strings?" And he said, "Well, you know, I play with three three, three strings. What most people play with six, you know, which is true." And he was the one that made me realize that I didn't have to have. It wasn't how many strings I had in the guitar or how busy I was on the guitar, but it was how I made it sing. And we spent the next week together. And we sat down every night in this little juke joint, and eventually I joined in. But it wasn't it wasn't until a good year, two years later, when I was in Ireland, that my um, my good friend Brian Frame had this idea of making this guitar that I have here with me now. And I started looking back on those days spending with Watermelon Slim, and I started I started thinking thinking about taking myself back to those days in the juke joint. And I started playing. Playing those notes that Watermelon Slim used to play. And every time I play this song, it's a special song because it takes me back to, to my roots, I guess. Arkansas, Mississippi, and uh, yeah. Red Street to a new clock style where watermelon, watermelon taught me all that stuff. To make the guitar sing. No 
home, baby. When I got the first freight train, get it back to a sweet long. That's the truth, Well, 